Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here today talking with Colleen Kelly with Tanuki Spider Cat. Please help me with the pronunciation, Colleen. Was okay. that right? Yeah. That's right. Tanuki okay, Spider great. Cat. And we're going to start with the first question, which is what was the sound that you heard all those years ago that started you on the path to where you are today? So definitely piano. And that's just because when I was a kid, there was a piano around. Um, I wasn't really listening to music. You know, I was just too young to be doing that. But piano was just a kind of pure form of emotional expression. And it just seemed to kind of contain everything inside of it. So that's what got me interested in music. And you had a piano in the home? Yeah, that's right. Had a piano in oh. the home. Yep. Did you take lessons for a while? I did take lessons. Um, and I can still sight read and, and do stuff like that. I still play piano. Um, it's kind of a reference instrument for me. It's just, there's so much ex expressivity there. It really opens me up to those possibilities of expressing yourself through uh, music, especially when you can't really find the words to say what you're feeling. So what is your process for writing a piece of music? It involves a lot of drawing. So one thing I'll do is, yeah, I write so many different pieces now. I'll draw kind of a picture. So since I can't draw out you know, like a piano composition of notes. I'll draw some kind of abstract picture of sort of different tones and sounds and how I want it to flow. Um, I don't really have like a standard way of doing it and I don't keep them. So it wouldn't even necessarily mean anything to me later. It's sort of like a working notes, working session thing. And I usually also draw how everything's connected and sort of try to meet the, the two things in the middle. Wow, that's great. Is there any uh, particular piece of gear that you find particularly inspiring? Uh, perhaps something that you'll be using for Wonder Valley 13? Yeah, well, a combo, a combo. So yeah, and, and I do use this for Wonder Valley 13. One is electronic cello. Um, kind of similar to piano for me. It just feels very expressive. Like that's what it's about. It's about emotion. And then I run some of that into a Eurorack module called the Morphogene. It's kind of like a tape splicer on steroids, you know, all CV'd out and with <laughs> different ways of deconstructing the sound. Um, and then to just kind of take one moment and then drill into that and out of it and into that, that's, yeah, that's kind of part of what my piece is about. So it's, it's inspired by that concept. That's amazing. So is there a, um, a connection between animation and painting and music for you? Yeah, so, yep, uh, it's in the, so I made a video, so the way I composed my piece for Wonder Valley, actually, I made a video first with, out music, I, I made a video first, and there is sort of a story, but it, it's very open, and I, and I hope that people can sort of make their own story out of it, I, <clears throat> But part of what it involves is sort of this kind of painting animals and scenes and kind of ever evolving bestiary soundscape. So once I made that video and then also shot some footage kind of in places that inspire me in San Francisco and merged those together, then I use that as a jumping off point for making like a composition to accompany it. Outstanding. Uh, 
the doing the painting and doing the stop motion animation is a little bit like experiencing the morphogene for yourself or something. It's like you're living in a different sense of time, almost like it, you know, time is stretching out. Everything you do is advancing time so little and you're sort of flowing through this timeless kind of, yeah, kind of space. And it's, uh, it's an interesting process to experience. And I sort of try to capture that in the music as well. It's sort of always looking for its settling point, sort of anxious and never, you know, never stable. Well, it so is amazing. Okay. Oh, thanks. I, it, it really is so different, and I really appreciate your work in that way. Come to Wonder Valley 13, uh, see all the art and, and music. I hope someday I get to, to visit, you know, where you are in person. But since we have distant shows now, you know, I'm really looking forward to everyone's, everyone's pieces. It should be great. Me too. Well, thank you very much for your time. 